in the field of zoology, the Quran says in Surah Anam, chapter number 6, verse number 38, we have made every animal that lives on this earth and every creature which has wings and flies in the air to live in community like the human beings. Today we have come to know that the animals and birds, like the human beings, they too live in communities. The Quran says in Surah Nahal, chapter number 16, verse number 68 and 69, it is Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who has taught the bee to build its cells in hills, on trees, and human habitations and to eat of what the earth produces and to find the spacious path of thy Lord with great skill. It was recently, just a few decades earlier, that a scientist by the name of Fawn Fresh, he got the Nobel Prize for describing the behavior and the movement of the bee. And what does the Quran mean by saying it has taught the bee to build its cells in hills, trees, human habitations, eat of what the earth produces, and find the spacious path of the Lord with great skill? Today, after science advanced, after Fawn Fresh described the movement of the bee, we have come to know that whenever a bee finds a new garden or a flower, it goes and tells its fellow bee the exact direction of that garden and flower so that it could collect nectar by a process known as the bee dance. So what we have come to know recently, the Quran says, it has taught the bee to find the spacious path of thy Lord with great skill. Today, in science, we call it the bee dance. And previously we thought it was the male bee which was the worker bee. Today we have come to know that it is not the male bee, it is the female bee which is the worker bee. And the gender used in the Quran in Surah Nahal, chapter number 16, verse number 16 and 69, is fasluki and kuli, meaning a female bee. No wonder Shakespeare in his play, Henry IV, he mentions about people talking among themselves, about the bee, that the soldier bee, the male soldier bee, they go and report to the king. Today we have come to know it is not the male bees, it is the soldier bee. They are the female bees, which are the worker bees and soldier bees. And they don't report to the king, but they report to the queen. Imagine, even the gender of the worker bee, the soldier bee is mentioned in the Quran as the female gender which we have come to know recently.